Hi, this is Amy from MadamDeals.com, and we are going to take every fashion challenge you have and resolve it for under $20 or less. So in this edition of Fashion Friday, we're going to take on the belt tail. And we're going to do it for under 20 bucks. This thing that often happens to you if you have a smaller waist, bigger hips and thighs, and you have a belt that you like to wear on your jeans and on a dress on your waist. So there are several ways that you could fix the belt tail. One, permanent way. Not so great if you want to wear this belt with something else other than this particular dress. So what I suggest you use is a floral wire. It's great. Awesome. Works very easily. Let's say that you don't have holes in your belt. Double stick tape, also awesome. Except that my children have used all of mine on purposes that were not fashion related. The other thing that's a phenomenal idea if you have a belt that doesn't have holes in it is double stick Velcro tape. You can buy it for about a buck 67 at, at Walmart. I get the industrial strength one. They're just little dots, circles. And you just stick them on. There's nothing easier than that. What I'm going to use today is what I'm going to use today is a safety pin. The reason why I use a safety pin is because it's easy to do. So you just merely go through the back, poke a little bit out, poke it back in. I suggest doing this with a mirror because it is rather difficult to do without a mirror, but you know. And hopefully you get it straight and it's not lumpy bumpy. Um, but anyway, it's great. It makes for a great streamlined look. And just in case you're wondering, the dress was $15 at Target from the Morona line. It was on sale from $24.99. The belt I got for a dollar. The safety pin was from my husband's dry cleaning and the shirt cost 99 cents to dry clean. And yes, we dry clean his shirts because he was in the military and ironing his shirts takes him like 30 minutes. And honestly, he uses at least 99 cents in starch for the shirts because they can stand up by themselves. So anyway, I hope that you enjoyed how not to have a belt tail by either cutting, using floral wire, using double stick tape, using Velcro dots, or using a safety pin. Thank you for turning in to this edition of Fashion Friday with MadamDeals.com.